Clark. It's collapsing. Wilson's going down. Crosby will be credited with the sack, but he was helped out by Coach. a host of his teammates. 19 in 2021, almost at 19. Uh, 19, 19 21. You talked about it earlier, James. The answer. So he comes yes. speed to power. The tackle sets, but then he has an answer. He goes back across the. Harris is in the backfield. Hardy on the move. Allen. Oh, almost crowned. It's incomplete, and they were looking inside. So far, seven runs, seven passes. And a 7 7 game. They get ran right into it, and they've got him. Max Crosby waiting. And each of the big rush ends have come up with a sack here in the first quarter. He's anticipating a quick throw because of the fact that he was getting single block. So, oh, it's got to be a quick throw. He was sitting there almost looking at Pickett and anticipating when he was going to jump. And then he saw him begin to scramble, gets off, hustles, makes a play. Second down, goal to go. Herbert, look out! Here comes Crosby! Trying to get away, he can't. Kelly back in. Allen on the move. Herbert will drop back. Here they're coming. And there he goes throwing. Intercepted. Picked off by Merrig. First turnover. And he's got some blockers ahead. Oh, that's excellent, Trent. Kelly remains second and nine. Here they come. Down he goes. Crosby gets him again. Here's Watson on a handoff, pursued and popped. Coming up from the secondary, Amik Robertson and Divine Diablo is in there as well. Season open receiver, get the ball out of his hands, and he's done a pretty good job of that here in this game. Here's Taylor thrown down to the ground. Patrick Taylor and Cosby makes that play. Great job converting some third downs and fourth down as well on that drive. A, a down on third down they have not been very good on. Love. Picked off, Spillane right to him. Spillane wrestled down inside the 10. And it looked to me like Jordan Love coming off of this play fake to Dylan. It looks like he sees him, but he, he must not have. From the 25 in the backfield, Dylan gets dumped by Max Crosby. And every time you look up, big 98 is cutting through that offensive line. It's amazing. I mean, Rasheed Walker, he just absolutely whiffs. I mean, he's anticipating that he's outside and that he's going to get up the field. So he's trying to block out to his left. And Crosby comes underneath. And, you know, we don't get a chance to watch the Raiders enough. But this they go back to three tight ends. You think play action, and here it is. Love sacked Crosby. He's got four tackles for a loss tonight. That's his first sack. Love protected in the air and picked second for Spillane. And Spillane there to clean it up. Watson the target. And the catch is made by Spillane, his second of the night. Four-man rush. Love, end zone. Intercepted. Good night. These offensive lines have not been able to hold up in protection on these down and distances. Third and seven. Jones going down back at the five-yard line. A former Patriot brings him down out of Jones rushed out. On the run. Intercepted. Right into the arms. Morig with the pick. Andrews. How will they back up that last drive? They start off with a busted play. As Jones has dropped for a four-yard loss. Getting right in there on Mac Jones. 
They have to get points on this drive. It's a trick play. As Cunningham comes in and he gets swallowed up. And it's Robertson who just got flagged, who comes in along with Crosby. So they try to. Jones. Five yards deep, and this is safety. The safety by Crosby. Nichols got to him also. You want to close out a game? Call on Max. He's becoming the closer for this team. He makes it very difficult, but watch the push up the middle, and then here comes on the outside. Defense is the offensive line, and we mentioned it. They've had six offensive line changes tonight, being their seven. A lot of moving parts for him. This one is caught. Reynolds. Now he loses the ball, and Spillane's got it for the Raiders. Yeah, Josh Reynolds does a great job coming back for the ball, and there's the ball coming out. Masterson is the one who strips him, and Spillane running to the foot. That's Crosby. Wow. Just came flying off the edge. And no gain for a guy that just doesn't stop. Well, you expect the play action with the quarterback and the threat of the boot to slow this guy down. But here comes Max Crosby. He's 100 miles an hour off the edge. Now, if you're Ben Johnson, the next time you get to second down in this situation, you do the boot, and you, they got to honor that. You can't allow the backside. St. Brown is put up. We'll get to all. Oh, here's the play. Hello. Max Crosby absolutely demolished the ball carrier, Jamison. Stancer. Laporta started in the backfield. Hand off to Reynolds again, not much. Spillane again. Tackle number seven on the night for the former Steeler, Robert Spillane, who's been a nice pickup. Now the Raiders are coming out of there, no signal, saying they have the ball. Crosby comes away with it. And they have indicated it's the Raiders' ball. And let's take a look. Fumble recovery by the defense. Fifth play of 20 yards or more allowed by the Raider defense. DeVito will Not step a... up in the pocket, and he's looking deep over the middle, and that ball is going to be intercepted. Amik Robertson leaping in front of Jalen Hyatt for the pick. Robertson still on the run. And all the way out to the 40-yard line. They have raved about Amik Robertson in coverage this year. He's gotten better and better, and he gets his second pick of the season. Falling backwards, Hyatt. First and 10 at the 25-yard line. DeVito over the middle, deflected, and it's intercepted. Caromed into the hands of Nate Hobbs. Hobbs inside the 30 and down near the Giants' 25. His first interception. And Slayton's going to run your curl right here. He has the window. He's working back to the quarterback. I don't like that he went with his hands that direction. Just go meet that ball in front of your face and catch it. Watch. He's going to turn his hands as if he's catching a ball over his shoulder. Go meet that football. Well, just so you know, you're, uh, you're glowing now. I mean, really, that's something Mark loves more than anything else. As DeVito scrambles and is dropped. At the 35-yard line, Adam Butler and Max Crosby combined to bring him down. And Tommy DeVito, the rookie from Illinois, has been pressed into duty the last... Using that motion again with Barkley, trying to figure out Manor's own. Third and four. Steps away from pressure. In trouble. DeVito spins, and down he goes. Bilal Nichols with the sack. Thirty four yard line of the Raiders. Here comes the pressure and down goes DeVito for the sixth time today. The Raiders have a sack. Tyree Wilson and Robert Spillane. Well, this is just an all out pressure. You're going to see two on the back right here. He's got to hit Bellinger across the middle. You see Bellinger crossing face with the safety right there. Absolutely right. And he's been nailed. So Connell. 
Third and eight. Pressure again. DeVito in trouble. Breaks free from the first contact, and down he goes in the arms of Adam Butler. Bernie was the first rusher. Second down and six here. Little bobble on the snap. DeVito under pressure, and down he goes. Sack number eight for the Raiders today, and this one belongs to Trayvon Merrick. On the offensive side. Second five, Garrett Wilson pressured by Coots. Did he knock it out? He did. I think the Jets got back on it. There's been 25 to go. Zach Wilson throws in traffic. It's picked off by Robert Spillane. Spillane taking off. He's down at the 40-yard line. Had opportunities elsewhere, and yet here he is leading the team in tackles and making one of the plays of the year for the Raiders. It's third and three for Tungo Bailoa. The pressure is there. The run is on. Hits the net. Gets the first and fumbles the ball. And it's picked up by Marcus Epps. All these situational things that go on that you have to make a decision. Is the ball out before the forearm or knee hits the ground? I think it's close enough. You have to take a look. A Vegas challenge and we step aside in South Florida. Tua, fake to Mostert, outside it goes, Hill, he got away from one, but he can't get away, on the outside, right there, by Polamau. Armstead the block, and he's got his tight end, and that is a loose ball, Hill had it, we think, and it was recovered on the fumble at the 33-yard line, grabbed by Diablo, on the hit by Hobbs, it is a turnover. It is a turnover for Miami. Their second turnover today, if it's a catch. And I think it is. Yeah, there's enough there to show that it's a catch. Minus six for the season. The Dolphins. First and ten. Fake to Moster. Blocked by Cotton. Going deep for Waddle and picked off. It's intercepted on the play by Pulamau. Tua Tungabailoa has just thrown his eighth interception of the season. It is the third Miami Dolphins turnover today. Well, it's just way too aggressive. I'm all for being aggressive, but when the safety is on top of the receiver by five yards, you're putting a lot of... Third down and eight. Good pocket. Here they come, Coons. He can't get Mahomes, look at him weave, down he goes! Crosby, what a sack! Number 11, playing hurt, bad wheel and all. It's the first sack by the Raiders today in a loss of seven. Here comes the Chiefs punting unit. Well, it looks like they have five at the line of scrimmage. They only rush three. You see the double team on the right by Crosby, but his relentless... Third and five. Dobbs, protection breaking down. Dobbs is in trouble, and down he goes. Robert Spillane got there. Max Crosby was in there. A whole host of Raiders to close out Joshua Dobbs, and the Vikings go three and out. There's Madison, a little delayed handoff, but it didn't delay Max Crosby. Penetration into the backfield, and Crosby isn't missing many of those. We can see Max Crosby watch this guy. The guard overshot the landmark right there. Blake Brandle, he went a little too wide on his pull. Crosby took advantage and had him in the backfield before that thing. All right, Chris, thanks so much. Here, third and 19 for the Vikings. Pressure coming, and down goes Dobbs. Max Crosby, 12 and a half sacks on the year. Long before it was declined. His well, sack of his career. Crosby declined it as soon as he got up. You see him just attack that right side and Brian O'Neill. Look at him. <laughs> Third down and three. Raiders rush four. Dobbs in trouble. Chased by Crosby, who's got him for a second time today. Well, Max Crosby is just in relentless pursuit. Right past O'Neal. Oh, he almost pried that ball out. I think O'Neal's...
kind of buckled a little bit. He's still he down on the field. He's trying to protect. He said he instilled confidence in me as a freshman when I really needed it, and I, I'll never forget that. And uh, it's cool that it impacts him all these years later. Second and ten, little shoulder shake. Look out, ball is out. As they take him down to the 42-yard line, Raiders think they have it, and they do. Malcolm Kuntz comes in, gets the sack, forces the fumble, and Las Vegas takes over. Tyree Wilson, rookie out of Texas Tech with the recovery. Well, they brought Spillane, 41, on the blitz, so that creates the one-on-one -on -one opportunity for Coons, who, by the way, has just been getting better and better on the opposite side of Max Crosby. A lot of people worry about putting two blockers on on Crosby for obvious reasons. 51 now has three sacks on the year. He has four tackles for a loss and just seems to be all of a sudden he just he has please better technique. He's always been athletic. Seconds, but uh, Patrick seven. Graham said, you know, he's it bought into the, the technical step. aspect of being a pass rusher and it's really paying off. He really is comfortable. So it's not just sitting in the pocket, relying on the running game and a play action pass. You can definitely take advantage of this this young man's legs. Start on the ground to the 30-yard line. There's Joshua Kelly. That ball is out as well. Raiders think they have it. Here come the officials. They do. Oh, boy. Jerry Tillery. Josh Jacobs just said, you know, we just rally around him. We, we, we love that he's been there and done it as a player, and we respect him as a coach, but uh, he, he gets these players to really buy in. Cole's kick. That ball is out. And again, a turnover. DJ Turner comes away with it. The ruling on the field is a fumble by the receiving team. Recovered I mean, by the kicker. DJ team. Turner just it's ripped it away from the rookie Davis. Darius Davis. I mean, it was almost like you saw it coming, and it was like, you're no, there's no way this is gonna happen again. There's no way they're gonna get a short field with a with another turnover. I'm go with the ball and get it out quickly. No huddle here. Stick looking. Look out from behind. And the ball is out. It's going to be ruled. It's that it's alive and going to the end zone right now for what is ruled a touchdown is John Jenkins. He was popped by Malcolm Koontz, who's had a gigantic night. So second down and 13. Oh, baby. Unbelievable. Jack Jones. They do it again. I mean, there are bad dreams, and there are. Mahomes, pocket collapsing, and the ball comes out. I think that would have been a fumble, but he recovered it. His arm was not moving forward. So it was Adam Butler who got to him first, and that was not an impressive three plays and beginning for the Kansas City offense. Loss of nine on this play. The right side of that offensive line, the ball comes back a little funky, and then you see it <laughs> trying to hold hands there. But Butler does a great job after the double team on Crosby. I'll tell you, Mahomes did a good job. Of Unheard of. Third and nine. Look it, and he's going down again. We got a marker. I honestly think they were offsides. I think there's a chance. Look at this. Ball's on the ground. Ball's on the ground. It's picked up by the Raiders. But they have a touchdown with Nichols. It was a direct snap that went wrong. Mahomes definitely. It's supposed to be a handoff to Mahomes into a option or a pitch possibly, or you could keep it. And I think Pacheco was gonna keep it, Mahomes thought. He was faking and he goes, whoa, you're actually trying to give it to me? And the miscues continue. We showed it earlier and what a huge play. Wow, what an interesting turn of events here. A Raiders defense has scored two touchdowns. Little chip shot. <laughs> Mahomes throws and he's picked off, and this one's going back for a touchdown. Two steps, two defensive touchdowns 
and it's Jack Jones who had a pick six last week. Unbelievable. You just called it last week. Just get the snap off in time. Minshew with pressure coming. Max Crosby has him, and now he's brought down. Adam Butler. Anyway, uh... Third and three. Sermon, and Crosby jumps on top of him. Big play by Max Crosby. An inviting fade target in the red zone. Here comes Crosby. Down goes Stidham. That was just pure speed. That's another thing we didn't talk about. They'll go empty. Crosby got a great start, and that spooked Jared Stidham. <laughs> no, it's weird. Max isn't a big guy. He's tall. He's lanky. He doesn't have, like, you go, man, that guy looks like a stud. But what you have is, boy, how did that guy get here so fast? That's exactly what happened. Kroll, the tight end, is over Crosby here as well. And he will help chip him off the snap. Stidham coming this way. And he goes down anyway. It's Isaiah Polamau, the safety. Very close, right at zeros. And it's a sack anyway. Adam Butler got there. They brought five, so they brought an extra guy. They probably were in man coverage. I didn't get to see it, but... Jones for a long time played for him in high school then at Arizona State as well. He's the reason he's here Koontz got there with a bull rush Malcolm Koontz absolutely rammed into Jared Stidham Sutton Not in the game for the balance of the second half Stidham launches came out of his hand oddly and a sliding try and an interception for Merrick inside the 20 and he got his hands underneath it.